Barcelona vs Real Madrid score, El Clasico wins in scoreless draw for first time in 17 years. Real Madrid and Barcelona played out a scoreless draw on Wednesday in El Clasico as it ended 0-0 for the first time since 2002. The rivals in La Liga both entered the day tied with 35 points but neither could go up 3 points in the table. Both teams saw golden chances cleared off the line. Only 6 shots went on goal in the entire game, with Real having 4. Los Blancos outshot the hosts 17-9 in the match that was postponed from October due to the violent protests in the Catalan region. By both earning 1 point, the teams remained tied atop La Liga on points with Barca holding an advantage on goal differential. Here are 3 takeaways from the game. Peak, Ramos come up crush. Barca's Gerard P cleared a Karim Benzema header off the line early on, and real Sergio Ramos did the same on a Lionel Messi shot to keep the game 8-0-0. Neither team created many good chances in what was a physical game featuring 8 cards in total and numerous crunching tackles. There were chances to be had on the counter but the defences performed well. Real Madrid had a couple of penalty claims that were not rewarded. Los Blancos also appeared to have scored with less than 15 minutes to go as Gareth Bale put away a cross, what would be assist man Ferlin Mendy was just offside, and VAR later confirmed the call. Here are highlights from the match. History made by Ansu Fadi, Ramos, and Zidane. A couple players made history in this match, including 17-year-old Ansu Fati of Barcelona. The Spanish U21 talent is the youngest player to play in El Clasico for Barcelona since Vicente Martinez way back in 1941. Ramos also made history in a sense, extending his record of most cards in El Clasico. He entered the day with 24 and is now on 25 after his yellow, putting him 5 ahead of Fernando Jairo. But the most impressive feat may be what Real Madrid coach Zinedine Zidane accomplished. He's the first coach in Real Madrid's history to not lose any of his first five El Clasicos at the comp. Zidane has won two and drawn three. When's the next meeting? The second meeting is in La Liga is scheduled for the weekend of March 1st, but you actually may not have to wait that long. In January, the Spanish Super Cup will be played. Usually that event pits the champion of La Liga against the Copa del Rey winner, which would have seen Barcelona take on Valencia. But as a way to increase interest overseas and surely with big financial implications, there are four teams involved now in this taking place in Saudi Arabia. Real and Valencia play on January 8, and Barca takes on Atletico Madrid on January 9. The winners face off on January 12. And it could be the second El Clasico of the season if Real and Barca both advance. You can watch La Liga all season long on Fabot, try for free. Relive our updates of the match below. Barcelona 0, Real Madrid 0, final score.